King of Kings, worship the Lord of Lords, worship the Lion of the Tribe of Judah, worship the Lord that died for your Calvary, worship the Lord that died that you might have life and have it in abundance, worship Him, He is awesome, He is worthy, He can do all things, the Lord that died, oh thank you Jesus, thank you Jesus, thank you Jesus, in Jesus name. We worship you. Yes, Lord. The lion of the tribe of Judah. Yes, Lord. The I am that I am. Yes, Lord. The little up of our heads. Oh God. The Lord that died for us at Calvary. Yes, the Lord that died that we might have life and yes, have it Lord. in abundance. Yes, we have come. Oh, King of Glory. I know there are people you are about to put their strongholds yes, in Lord. this service this morning. May nothing stop you from doing so in the name of Jesus. Amen. I pray as a result of this murdering Sunday. Oh God, dying businesses, dwindling businesses, we receive strength once again. Oh Lord, to be prospering in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. As a result of today's program, I decree and declare women here looking for the fruit of the womb nine months time from now they will embrace their own babies one by one in the name of jesus oh, father as a result of today's program speakers here oh lord are supposed to have married and they are not wasting their useful lives in their father's house come another modern sunday in 2020 oh father they will attend it from their material
demonic homes in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, as a result of today's program, oh God, all students here having academic carryover, it will be turned to be academic excellence in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, those under the manipulation of witches and wizards will be delivered by the fire and thunder of your word in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, as I'm preaching, may the healing ingredient of your word ooze out of this altar into every nook and cranny of this church Amen. to heal all those that are supposed to be healed, Amen. to set free all those that are supposed to be set free Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, I have not forgotten that you are the message. I am just a messenger. Lord, cause me to forget whatever that you wouldn't want me to say here. And do help me to remember all that will be an immense benefit to this, your children. That at the closure of today's program, every one of us will have this singular song. And that is, I'm going to be with the Lord. And He indeed blessed me. And so, Lord, with a singleness of heart and purpose, we say, Father, speak. For we, your children, hear it. Amen. I stand on the name of Jesus. With the collaboration of the faith of my brethren, I bind Satan and his cohorts. Amen. I cast them out of this place. Amen. I decree they are not permitted to operate in this place. Amen. In Jesus' name. Amen. Let us give the Lord a round of applause. Amen. Let's do something better, something better, something better. Hallelujah. You may be seated. God bless you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Permit me to appreciate some few persons. I want to thank God by, for all those that make something good to happen for God in this place. It is my heart desire that God in heaven will bless you continually. In the name of Jesus Christ. I want to thank God for Brother Bonnie that brought me here. Um, I think some two years ago or something. The Lord is your strength. We tell Brother Ekeledo in the name of Jesus Christ. I want to thank the women, especially the um, cabinet members of the women. I want to appreciate um, Mrs. E. Beto in a special way. And I want to appreciate Mommy Odega for everything. These people have been so committed. And I thank God because the program has been a whole success. I want to appreciate in a special way Mommy Ebele. She is, um, I, I, I like words. I just say may God in heaven keep her and may the Lord in heaven grant her all her heart desire in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I want to appreciate Engineer Odega I knew how much he spent on the phone to be able to bring me here. And of course, I don't think anything would have brought me here if not him and God. Because I canceled three different churches program in order to be here. One Holy Trinity, one Pentecostal, and just like that. But I thank God for everything. I believe that Jehovah is about to unleash his power in a special way, even in this service, in the name of Jesus Christ. I want to appreciate in a special way my pastor, my advocate, okay, my venerable, um, venerable Chudi. This is the third time that I'm preaching for him. I want to thank God for his life, for endorsing my coming. I pray that God in heaven will bless him continually and then use him to take us to our Canaan land in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I want to appreciate all the musicians. We pray together within the week. God bless you. I want to celebrate the mothers. Can we give a round of applause unto the Lord as we celebrate the mothers? God bless you. The Lord will keep you. The Lord will, will, will take you to another level of life. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Please do not forget the bottom point of this program will be in the evening today at 5 o'clock at 5 o'clock so everybody get ready every married man or woman do not exempt yourself from the evening program because it's loaded 
as I go all over the world, I discovered there are four types of marriages. Four types of marriages. Number one, the one that began well, but at the same time ended in divorce. That is the first type of marriage. The second type of marriage is the one that began well, and then when problem comes, the woman will go to her father's house and spend something like six months. Ayoba kwa ayoba. Or the man will just pick his portfolio for three months, um, leave the house for the woman. And after all said and done, they still come together. Like the second type of marriage. The third type of marriage is the one that began well, and they can say all manner of things to themselves. And they will not be thinking of divorce or separating for a time. And the fourth type of marriage is the one that began well and have never had a problem in life since they began. In the evening, just get ready. Amen. Okay, I have a lot of things to tell us. Of course, you know. Okay, can we pick our Bibles now as every protocol is duly observed? Can we do some readings? I'm going to preach this morning. So I would want us to do the readings for now. Let's go to our text for this program. And that is 2 Corinthians chapter 10 verse 4. 2 Corinthians chapter 10 verse 4. Everybody, we are going to read it together at the count of three. 2 Corinthians chapter 10 verse 4. Are you there? Okay, thank God, Preto. Even if you've not opened your Bible, the thing is on the screen. Okay. At the count of three, we are going to read. Are you there? Oh. Second Corinthians chapter 10, verse 4. Everybody, three, go. For the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, but mighty through God to the pulling down of strong hosts. Amen. Let us go to Second Kings chapter 3. Second Kings chapter 3. We are going to take two verses 26 and 27. Second Kings chapter 3, 26 and 27. I'm going to read verse 26. We are going to read verse 27. Second Kings chapter 3, verse 26 and 27. Are you there? Okay, I read mine, and then you are going to use a very loudable voice. That is the one you are going to use for verse 27. Okay, King James Version, 2 Kings chapter 3, verse 26, he says, And when the king of Moab saw that the battle was too sore for him, he took with him 700 men that drew swords to break through even unto the king of Edom, but they could not. Everybody, verse 27, 3, go. Amen. You tried. I give you 60%. But I want to give you 100. One more. Let's go to Psalm 50, verse 5. Psalm 50, verse 5. Psalm 50, verse 5. I want you to bag 100% now as you read with a very loud voice. Psalm 50, verse 5. Have you seen it? Even if you have not, it is on the screen. Okay. Psalm 50, verse 5. Everybody, three, go. Amen. I think you have 87%. That is a pass mark. Now look at me, eyeball to eyeball. Excuse me. I have come with a heavy heart. And I want to maximize my coming to this place. I do not want to leave any stone unturned. I want the Almighty God to use the team of this unique women program to take us to where we belong. 
Amen. Pulling down strongholds in what? In families. Pulling down strongholds in families. It is true that we have another woman, a builder. Um, that is why we're going to dwell much in the evening. Okay. But I'm speaking on a general team. Pulling down strongholds in families. And the women of this church have a project. Which I don't think there's any member of this church that does not know. That the women in this place have a project. And I want to believe the Almighty God that is going to use me and you this morning to make something beautiful to happen for Him, then to this church and to our individual lives in the name of Jesus Christ. So, my topic is a very simple one my battle seat for God to pull down my strongholds. My battle seat for God. To pull down my what? Strongholds. What is a stronghold? It is something good. Good. It is something that has been in your life for a very long time. You turn on manner of prayers. You have fasted. You have consulted a lot of people. But the thing seems to be a mountain in your family, a mountain in your business. A mountain in your life. You do not know the next thing to do. I bring this to you. God is saying, I have a solution. And the solution we get to our individual lives, our businesses, our families, in a time like this, in the name of Jesus Christ. Now I want to speak on what we call seed. S-E-E-D. I'm beginning from the second place that we read. And that is 2 Kings chapter 3, verse 26 and 27. The Bible made us understand that the king of Moab was fighting a battle with the Israelites. You knew nobody defeated the Israelites in their own time because God had always been with them. And the Bible said this man had two things that used to win battles for him. Number one, the Bible said he had 700 war men. That wherever he went to battle in those years, he never went with them at the beginning. And the Bible made us understand that when the battle becomes so, he will go and bring them. In 2 Samuel chapter 23, the Bible made us understand that these 700 war men used to fight like lions. And wherever he went with them, he will surely win. So when he was fighting with the Israelites, the Israelites were killing the people of Moab. The Bible made us understand that he went and brought the 700 women in this place. And the Bible said the Israelites killed them like no man's business. The man shouted and said, oh, I've not seen a battle like this. However, I must still win. And what did he do? In verse 27, while you read of 2 Kings chapter 3, the Bible said the man went at the back of his house. And laid hand on his eldest son. The Bible specifically made us understand that it will be his eldest son that will be the king after him. And brought him out in an open field and killed him as a seed for God to give him the victory over the Israelites. And the Bible said when he did that, God was touched. God told the Israelites, go back, go back. This man has done what ordinarily no other man can be able to do. Go back, go back. And so, through seed, this man won. Operator, can you bring Luke chapter 8? I just want us to take verse 3. Luke chapter 8, verse 3. Luke chapter 8, verse 3. We ought to have started reading from verse 1. But let us just read verse 3. Luke chapter 8. Amen. Now he says, And Joanna, the wife of Chusa, Herod steward, and Susanna, and many others who provided for him from their soft times. That is New King James Version. Who provided for him from their soft times. Can you change it to King James Version now? Amen. Now he says, And Joanna, 
the wife of Chusa, Herod Stewart, and Susanna, and many others which ministered unto him of their sometimes. May the Lord in heaven open our eyes. I just want to thank God for women all over the world as I travel from here and there. You see, when a woman decides to serve God, nothing stops her. You knew that Mary Magdalene and some other Marys, they were the powerhouse of Jesus Christ when he was preaching here on earth. They were able to do what men didn't do in order for the gospel to, to be properly propagated to all the areas that the gospel is supposed to go to. And the Bible said Jesus Christ was able to minister in Samaria, he was able to minister in Galilee, he was able to minister in several other places because of some few women. The Bible specifically made us understand that these women followed Jesus wherever he went with their substance. Jesus, you are going to preach in Samaria today. What type of vehicle are you going to use? Like a horse. Let us pay for it. Jesus, you are going to preach in Galilee tomorrow. What type of food are you going to eat? And how many persons are going to go with you so that we know what to do? And the Bible said they were sponsoring the work of Jesus Christ. Now if I ask us a question, where do we belong today? The Bible talked about um, Tabitha in Acts of Apostles chapter 9. The Bible said this woman had a ministry. And what's the, what was the ministry? Sewing clothes to the widows. When this woman died, whether the other women, the widows had the type of meeting, I don't know. But the Bible said they came together flinging the clothes that she made for them while they were alive. And they were crying. I mean, the way they wept broke the heart, the heart of the apostles. And they went looking for Peter that had the gift of raising the dead. And by her work, she was brought back to life again. If anybody tells you, as you are hearing me, that your salvation will not take your time, that serving God will not take your money. That serving God will not take almost everything you have. And even your life. The person who tells you that has not told you the truth. Because the martyrs, you knew they gave their life for this gospel to be able to get to us. Many times I used to say, when you look at the life of Jesus Christ, I was taken to heaven in 2000 and heaven and 2007. And then I used to put it to people that by the grace of God on my life, both here and abroad. hotel wa in 2007. I decree that none of us will miss heaven in the name of Jesus Christ. You see the magnitude. Jesus left that most beautiful place to come and die for me and you here. On Weberema. Oh no. What have you put in for the propagation of the gospel? Jesus was crucified on the cross. You knew Peter. Peter was crucified upside down for this gospel to be preached. Paul, that great man that wrote a lot of epistles, he was beheaded in Rome by a king called Nero. Paul never ran away. Paul never pleaded for mercy. For the gospel to be propagated. James, the brother of Jesus, was son and son. James For the preaching of this gospel. He didn't run away. You know, John the beloved, they made us understand that when they were about killing him, the, the, the pot of oil was on a point, um, 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 uh, boiling point, and they bundled him and put him there. And the story made us understand that nothing happened to him. They said, hey, this one born your own. We know how to keep people like this. They then took him to the island of Patmos. It was at that place that John saw God and wrote the epistle, the revelation. You see, when people think you are going to die, because every time you are in the mission, when a donation was to be made, you will be one of the first persons. And your own might be the highest. 
people think that you will die. God is saying, no, my hands are on your life. If there's anybody that can tell me in this church that if you have to do it, and then the seriously, no if God says, Woe unto me that I will not honor those that honor me. And then when he downed on Stevie for them to stone him to death. In Acts of Apostles, chapter 6, chapter 7, chapter 9, the Bible made us understand that why they were stoning him. At the, the, the time he was about to die, the Bible said he knelt down. The heaven was made open to him. And he saw the glory. He saw where he was going to. And he began to shout. He started shouting. In my own translation, He said, Oh, I don't know the glory you have seen. Several of us crucify God every day. Some men leave their wife, they go to another woman. It is because they've not seen the glory of God. Some women leave their husband, they go to another man. It is because they have not seen the glory of God. Some of us post secret. Some of us do con things contrary to the will of God. It is because we have not seen the glory of God. There's nobody that has seen the glory of God. The gospel will be propagated. And that is through me and you. What has the gospel taken you? On we go get no katara no wa give entia your bank account for the preaching of the gospel. I've done it how many times? To some of you who have been in our nature, God of Abraham and St. John's. Every year we used to plan that program, St. John's. There are two Anglican churches known all over the whole world. The first one is Semba Tagoda because of the healing and deliverance unit. Wherever you go all over the world. The second Anglican church known all over the world is St. John's Fege because of the God of Abraham. It attracts up to 10,000 participants every year. And for years we've been planning it. The one of some three or four years ago took me a lot. You know, it, it, it used to, we used to spend 10 million naira. That has 50 brothers and sisters that bring 10 million naira every year to sponsor that program. That everybody has a work to do. And so, once upon a time, I will just um, interact with them, encourage them to give. The one or some three years ago, after interacting, encouraging them to give. There used to be a brother, he used to bring up to 700,000. He stood up, he said, brethren, I don't want to discourage anybody. But the God of Abraham of this year, I'm not going to bring anything. Because I made a vow in my village to build a church for them single-handedly. He said, every cobble I get goes into that project. And I want it to be completed in a record time. It's not that I do not want to give Biko. Kang Arimonyo when discouraged. He sat down. And then I said, okay, let us give everybody bent down. God said, Joseph, empty your bank account. I said, God, we have billionaires, and seriously, we had them in that place. God said, Don't ask me questions. In my account, what the home when I got on it was 300,000. And don't we defend your Ijegawa women? That was in June, in August. So I stood up, I said, Brethren, we must obey God. Because if I don't obey God here now, I will have guilt conscience that I wouldn't want to dwell there. So that God wants me to empty my bank account. I have 300,000. Within the week, today is Saturday. Within the week, I'm going to close it, I mean empty it and bring it to the church. I sat down. After sitting down, that brother that used to bring up to 700,000 stood up. Now look at his words. He says, if an ordinary evangelist can close his bank account, Emptied it and brought 300,000. I'm bringing 500,000. He stood after city. A brother stood up again and said, I'm bringing 500,000. 
And before you knew what was happening, a January this year, I was invited to pray for Sembas Aguda. And you know that Sembas Aguda, they are they have a building. I don't know either Jesus um, something. The that building had been there for some time. The venerable spoke to me and said, "Please, evangelist, please move some people." We want to complete that building in a record time. It is like an unabusive, shameful thing to us. And then I challenged the people to give some bad I go there. Oh no. Men send the guy put up from 100,000. Put up. Six brothers came out and said, We are giving one, one million naira. So you can call the variable. So you know what I'm talking about. Six brought the more than six said we are giving one one million. Five hundred thousand. I wouldn't know whether they were up to seven. One hundred and two hundred thousand. Hey, Ruru, hundred and some fraction. I'm not talking about fifty thousand. Now, Omero Bieje Riego. We go Bieje Batego. Some of us we know Bieje Riego and Yemuro Bieje Abata. Some of us we know Bieje Abata and Yemuro Bieje Riego. And many times we are just like children. A man will buy a packet of um, um, biscuits and we give to that child. Dear after and says, now nah, give me one. The child will just do like this. Now nah, give me one. Like this. Forgetting that if I can buy, if I can give this person one of the biscuits, he can buy up to ten packets and say, eat. Can funny the jigger time. David asked the Israelites, what do you have that is not given to you by God? And then I put this question to each and every one of us. Members of St. Paul's, so here. what do you have that is not given to you by God? Flash your mind back. Let me begin with the sisters. Mommies, look at how beautiful you are. God in heaven has endowed you, elevated you, giving you a good husband. I mean, today, you have your jeep, you have your car, I mean, so on and so forth. Flash your mind back when you were just a maid. Flash your mind back when you were just in your ma father's house. When you were nobody, the Lord brought that young man to you. And today, you are a dick, madam. Now, I can ask you this question. How many women have you caused to stand in this church? How many women in Kenya in the 2000 Kahawere Buruji na Bagari na street in Lagos State here? You see, men, the, 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 the husband of a woman died here in Lagos. It was a vicar. The woman thought that everything has ended. The vicar asked her to enter the vehicle. She entered the vehicle. The, the vicar drove her to where they used to sell fruits here in Lagos State and gave her 2000. See, see, I'm not a potter. Just so I'm going to buy one bonnet of fruits. Fruit 2000 can one year rebel. Where's one we are in a university? Fruit 2000 can one year the battle and a Lego state. You know, how many women have had your wrap around rapper here? Key way sustain here in God. How many boys have you coerced or less with your husband to make to help them in life? Didn't they? Now I go to Ndina Anweba. Look at how thick you are. God in heaven has blessed you. Flash your mind back when you came into Lagos State some years ago. What did you come with? Abba, Ghana must go. Back or back. Today, the Lord has remembered you and made you great. You may go to Lagos State. Several establishments. Obia kagane oku 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 ego ge pachia Ekele diri chineke na asi no no chori ga ala no eba Brethren if we become men and women of sacrifice or preto let me have some 50 verse 5 some 50 verse 5 Now let us see some 50 verse 5 King James version Amen some 50 verse 5 Psalm 50 verse 5. Operator, are you there? Psalm 50 verse 5. Okay, I think I can say it off head, offhand. It says, Gather 
gather my saints together. Okay. Gather my saints together unto me. Who are the saints? He says, those that have made the covenant with me by sacrifice. Hey, I will serve you. Nkebe zoku made no ezugo epota this morning say naiku kede go no bu we want to food the bill kamara chine ke si aburi aru ni aman sopuru nde na sopuri ya kamara uti ke si nye si a chine ke we la wobudu la wobudu la wobudu the silver and gold belong to God when you read that Psalm 50 down he says, Chinekesi, when I ask you to give me, is it because I am hungry? Is it because I do not have? He said, if I were to be hungry, I have all to 1,000 cows and 1,000 heels. I have seen men and women of sacrifice. When I came here, sometime, I think last year or some two years ago, I told us, if you are from Allah, Eba Allah, and this is your church, you know that a Manel Anglican church in Allah was single handedly built by a brother. If you go to our nature, housing estate phase two, there is a church called ECWA, Evangelical Church of West Africa, was single handedly built by a brother. I am from Imo State. One of the Roman Catholic cathedral, cathedral in my father's land was single handedly built by a man. Cathedral, I didn't say church building. If you belong to Newi and this is your church, you know that the biggest Roman Catholic church at Newi is being built single handedly by a man. Mbafaya, almost everybody knows. Uh -huh. Oburu Yamabu, the richest man na Newi. And the key Oburu Yamabu, the richest man na that Catholic church. No Obu, Obi, then when Obi, a genetine kife. Obi, a genetine kife. If you are from Umu Navy, and this is your church, you know that Cathedral of St. Gabriel at Umu Navy was single handedly built by a man, Sir and Lady Ben, Emeka Ben. You may know him. When I got there for a program and saw the magnitude of the church, oh, this is what I said. Because not that Sir and Lady Emeka Ben completed the church and left it like that. All the fines, the Kaja, were single handedly fixed by them. All the pews, all the pews were single handed. All of them. Donated by Sir and Lady Hansi Chinek and Awal. Hey, this morning I chunky they touched. And don't get more see so can doors or gara, you gonna run alarm. And God may not be happy with you. Because you know when God is saying, What have you done? God is saying, I am ready to bless you. Did you know I took time in the night worrying and crying for God to use me to bless you this morning? My He gave me a revelation. He said, because of familiarization, several people here are not blessed. I am in the presence of God. So I'm not talking of what I just um, 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 uh, uh, what that came out of my heart. God told me, say, because of familiarization. Oh, when the Hana Chinekebuzoba. If a chineke but I'm not bad. Or see, because of that, they are not being blessed. No, God, we have in your chineke. I see, hey, a gun near about hundred thousand. Ke do tum ke sige wa pota ten. No, wa pota ten. I'm a man for fun tara. We make a hundred thousand. Manonyo abo na yana chineke na gije. 
na abu a foolish person. Foolish person. Whatever the Lord tells you to do, yes, my Lord. Empty your bank account, yes, my Lord. Do not go out today, yes, my Lord. Go and help the less privileged, yes, my Lord. December last year, Madibua, Baramoto through me. December last year. Then a brother gave me a gift last year for my Christmas. A vehicle of almost 3 million naira. He bought it 2 million, 800 and some fraction thousand. And this is only a money now for the Niru Niru for more than two years. Money for the Niru Niru. He's not even an Igbo man, he's an Isoko man. And money up the phone up for the period within the period of maybe one year or two years, and you have a phone. Just text. Man, a December, he had more. Na more no one. One brother, na Saint John's. But I don't. There's only the calling the name of that brother. This brother brought us up. Man, no one will He is an elder, na Saint John's figure. Even now, God told me, I want to give him a gift. So my Kia caravan, a man on air, correct one sound. Mboya, Siabia, Nemota, Ego Niki, when he keep with him comfortably. On same comfort, or Chibochi, comfortably. Say, yes, or walking around mountains here, he gave with him, we ask him, yes, you have a deal. Then in way to call Ego from Elbere, go with it from that Kia caravan. There used to be a brother. Oh, this brother, Nefe Chineke, he said by April last year. I got the one you have to see. But by see, by your see, by see, that God wants me to tell you. I got the one you see, many better better. When you're Roman Catholic, even a brother, only Anglican, more Pentecostal, or see, many better better. China, can see more baggy by see you. Near get low target, near get bully, get near get feature gang, yam many. So, October, I gave him a text. I said, Brother, by see you. God wants me to tell you that 2019 Gabu a year of celebration for you. I said, Hey, amen. Ofumai, but I'm far now. God is about to do something. Today, but I am not complaining. God is faithful. Let it be to me according to his will. Or Maron at that time. Neji go me go je go this moto um a low 300 in that and he was here for you people correct on marron and a couple here i didn't want to tell him so again we were serious a couple lawyer i paid for a driver to take it to that place you see i drop around here somewhere because i wanted to surprise him so manager city program i think in enugu i then went home now but around eight o'clock can they move on nobody was coming out Onye Ghana Abia by this time. Who has come to disturb us? Who? Finally, when he came out, he was just looking. I didn't want him to see my face. Face. I drove the vehicle in there. But prior to that time, eight days ago, me a dear fire na azuya na humota more for a fire. Oh no! He began to shed tears spiritually. He told me he said nobody will tell me that this is for me. So God, about Akidi, God, this is the way you remembered me. Today he's laughing. How many persons are laughing because of you? I have two secrets in preaching this gospel. Number one, I do not joke with holiness. The Bible says without holiness, no man shall see the Lord. You needed to pray for many of us preaching this gospel today. Several people preach us into fornication, into adultery. Several preachers today joke name a miracle. In fact, in the job of today, name a miracle, chokazri carry, then he preach this gospel. They won't suppose. I don't joke with holiness. I have another secret in preaching this gospel. And what is it? Seed giving. Giving. About my secret. Every year I sponsor the crusade of our village. In my channel crusade, 200,000. I sponsor that crusade single-handedly with some friends. And so the more I give, 
the more God gives me open doors. Am I him? What that is? A stumbling block on your way this morning. Am I in here? Bo? A stronghold. Oh, when a seed, it got planted here this morning. Seed, chineke, a break here, that stronghold. Are you a woman looking for fruit of the womb? Ten more minutes, I want to stop this message. Are you a woman here looking for fruit of the womb? Again, any medical doctors of this world, can you come and give it to God this morning? I've been in the presence of the Lord. Let me lay hand on you. Can you marry? Machine can I say better or not? If my memory could carry me, I've lost count. Nde chine kenye nengwa through Joism all over the world. If I can begin with Lagos State here, St. Paul's Anglican Church at Itire. When I was invited there to preach some years ago, I challenged women looking for the fruit of the womb. And the brother came and gave 100,000. Whatever I tell you, I don't tell lies. A believer in our church, I go miles. A brother gave 10,000. We are here the next month, I bought my food. Or same sir. As I'm talking to you now, I am coming from the hospital with a, a result of the text. He said, I missed my period this new month. My husband sent me for a text. He said, I'm coming from the hospital now, it is positive. I was invited to pray for St. Paul's, Maza Maza. Now, a man called me on phone, I'm not going to now. Or some evangelist, you were here in our church last month. Or see, I got married to a woman eight years. Yeah, move for eight years of what she Or see, she didn't take in talk less of miscarrying. Or when see this new mold, I saw the seed. And did you know that my wife missed her period? I sent her for a test, it is positive. I was invited to pray for St. Michael Cathedral Coca. A woman called me on phone. I'm not going to now. Or see, my evangelist, look at her words. Or see. Since you visited our church, it is like all the women looking for the fruit of the womb are now pregnant. Or see, my man, I'm two women. I got head the cat. Or see, both of them are now pregnant. I was invited to pray for All Saints Cathedral of Jueleba. After I beckoned the husband and wife looking for the fruit of the womb to come, while I was about to leave that place, a woman stood on the road. Seen a man her cross. And look at her words. Or see, evangelist, this my barrenness has put me into shape. Or see, evangelist, is it because I'm an accountant? Or you can name a nano computer for now, chamo for 24 hours. And see, mama, you people bring me to your church every January. January next year, I have laid hand and prayed for you. You bring your child in geometry, as she said, amen. And January the next year. The whole thing. That woman has given birth to about three children now. It was at Isoko, Good Shepherd Marine Beach, Isoko Anglican Church. Eba came from barrenness. A woman that was barren not for five years, not for ten, not for fifteen years, seventeen years barrenness. Seventeen. One hundred thousand only. Men they were about to upgrade their musical department. I laid hand while she was coming, she was crying. I said, Mama, this thing that makes you to cry are ah, just like the Egyptians you see today. You will not be able to see them again tomorrow. She found her. They brought her to the altar. They come met to Oh no. A bouncing baby boy. Thereafter, that bouncing baby. Can you give a round of applause unto the King of Glory? <laughs> Hallelujah. Amen. It was a Saint Cyprian Cathedral, Ababa, Enugu. That a woman, that church is so big. If you've been there, it's so big. So after the first sermon, I was all shut into the vestry. I was just having rest to come for the second uh, uh, message. A woman just carried a child, came to the vestry. And she was kneeling down. She said, Evangelist, touch this child. He came through you. Evangelist, touch this child. He came to you. She said, Evangelist, I'm a teacher. 
I just came here on a holiday and you were having a program in this church and as you ministered, you challenged women looking for the fruit of the womb. She said, the evangelist, I showed the seed, just 10,000. She said, you laid hand on me. Or see, my evangelist, I took in and get back to this child at the age of 46 years. 46. That testimony encouraged me and all. Is there anything too hard for God to do? So all of you women looking for the fruit of the womb, can you look unto the Lord come this morning? Give something that will make you to cry. This morning, that is my secret. If I be a man of God, if I am living a holy life, if God is with me, and if the calling I have is from God, I can never lay hand on you this morning. Five broid will be turned into fine boy this morning. I decree that. Spencers who are here, you want to get a good husband. I challenge you this morning, all of you Spencers, in the name of Jesus who called me, come and make something good to happen for God. Let us see. Machine Zibodi. I have always said, Obrune Lota, Di Marachine Kovuma, Manona Pawe Baru. That is nice. Mano Brune Lota Pati, Marachine Kovuma, Manona Zavana Venza. I think that is better. If for money, I don't know what Brundo caught. Obru, if women and women get this year, give one question or two, Norma. Be here, then from here, Bawa Heaven. On what if they bad? Like you want Baramoto, Norma. Abramoto Chizoba, Murujimoto Napo Chizoba, Moto Gambo, from here to uh, uh, I don't know this place very well. But from here to maybe uh, uh, after Jack on the Gate, you see Chineke Mota, Dugan Jack on the Gate, Napo Amnoso, Ngenegi Hedendo, or Moto Difa, or Murujimoto Maro Ganya, no matter pay Fumi, me bara, you see me a Potaginashi fuel fuel, Abru Diama, when you feed the Kamutoma. When he says he satisfies those that love him with good things. And I believe the God who called me have a heavy heart. Come! Oh, no, 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 Reward Gambia, one, two, three. See this flat, both for the less privilege. This flat, both for Uma Uma Jadu. This flat, both for um Ndu Kochuku Nganazuna Bible School. Just Egoni na Natania. Oh yeah, reward. Obu no broya, no reward. Onye Hanano. How many years are we going to live here? At most one hundred and twenty years. Obia can get you a quit here in Tanity. Hey! Hey! In Tanity! What are the seed you have sown waiting for you in eternity? I am weeping this morning. Chineka, what's it Many of us are in Abba. Lenden Abisha, Lenden Muslim. Leife Haneme. Ndi Boko Harama. Habo Pani Human Beings. The Boko Harama, how we can now we, how we no look, and they have left all of them. Iga, Jim Lucy Terechi, Hana Marog, one of the motors of Boko Harambo, one of the motors of Boko Harambo hates life more than the ways that Christians love life. Hate life more than the ways that Christians love life. What are you? As I'm about to summarize now, as I'm about to close. I want you to think. I don't want to believe that no one will be able to do this by this time next year. She is a woman. 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 One young man at First World Gospel Church here. I preached in their church several years ago. They didn't even ask me to raise some seed. Did you know after preaching, this young man has surrendered. He was crying. And he gave 100,000. Crying. Man, I laid hand on him. Within three months, God is here. Somebody gave him a credit facility of 23 million naira. 23 million. 
If for man in men and doors, or they might, if you believe for struggle, struggle, struggles, there are two kinds of gifts. Number one, the one, and I want gift out of convenience. Gift out of convenience. That one, you were one million. Nene chineke, 50,000. That is gift of convenience. My name when I'm not that one, I'm about gift or sacrifice. Gift or sacrifice. Me when one million, you are willing to give God 500 or the whole one million. See chineke, or give with the rego. Can lao budo. Nene na, na nene a arroga aru. On kaha ne meka chineke kudie or say something. Can you bow down your head? I want you to talk to God right now. I want you to ask God, what would you want me to give? How much do you want me to give this morning? George naked. You are not giving to me. You are giving to God. Or chineke man, eba langozi a yisore yisore. Bow down your head, bow down your head, everybody. Just talk to God, talk to God. Ask Him. Elen hi choro kanye chineke. Kipe gozi em, gozi ezi no biolom. Kipe wapo. This word, mountain. This word, stronghold. In my hope. Kedi he? Kipe wapo mama. Kipe wapo mama hu anaya. Like it in a yah, or when a man he cannot sleep until he has taken drugs for three thousand naira in onicha and don't talk on for years every day, three thousand naira drugs for years. Come to Kenya for a month, can't try for a year. My God in heaven has given you life. I have believed God that some of you gain one million, two million, five million now. I believe God. 500, 200, 100, 50,000, 100, 10,000. I'm your capacity. 5,000. Mare shinda halakoto. Raba leka na Mare labakanda. What is God in heaven telling you to do? Mare shinda. God can ask you to surrender your vehicle. God can ask you to surrender your house. Na lego state here. Kereya we go tala. Eje eba eje ano no chine kono. And don't moge no more moge. I have suffered in life. Yes. You do not have money. You have a landed property. You do not have money. You have a house. You do not have money. You have a vehicle. You do not have money. You have something. Father, amplify my hand. Cause this my hand to be turned now. To be your hand. Lord, I've been with you. You have spoken to me that you're about to elevate people and take them to another better horizon. May nothing stop you from doing it. As I lay hand, let it do not be an ordinary hand again. You this land to take your children to where they belong in a time like this. Take all that glory for having answered my prayers. As you move your children to give this morning, so that you bless them in Jesus' name, Amen. Raise your head up. Jesus Christ. I want to begin by asking how many of us catching a case. Mere mi homa no tutwa kamu from one hundred thousand. I didn't say fifty. I said from one hundred. It could be one million. It could be two million. It could be three million. Abu na chine kagbazo go kuk ke puteba from one hundred thousand. Come, I want to lay hand on you, and I want the members of this church to watch these men and women that are coming out. If God in heaven is with me, then I will not lay hand on you, and you remain the same. God bless you. Wherever you are, I want you to start coming out. From 100,000. God bless you. Nani Amara. Eh, Nani Amara. Amara. 
No music, no music, no music, no music. Nani ya mara. Konyo bola ya rinya yisi. Arike giba mara. Umoma giba mara. Ego giba mara. Konyo bola ya rinya yisi. Nani ya mara. Eh, nani ya mara, amara. Nani ya mara. Konyo bola ya rinya yisi. I know you are here. Can you start coming? God bless you so that we can save the time. God bless you. All of you. From 100,000. Can you quickly come? I want to lay hand on you. God bless you. God bless you. Thank God for your life, mama. No music. No music, please. Organic. No music for now. If any children are able to please. Oh, if it's good job. God bless you, sir. You can? Okay. Yes, yes, sir. Start coming. I know you are here. We have many of you in this place. God bless you. Jehovah, we're a mother. Jehovah, we're a mother. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you from 100,000. And don't know how much you make it or not. Amen. God bless you. From 100,000. 1 million, 500,000, 200,000. God bless you. God bless you. Keep on coming. Thank God for you. Uh, it's engineer. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Amen. That's another woman now. God bless you. God bless you. You have a mother mother. It's touching you. It's touching people here. Please allow God to touch you. I didn't say give me. If I were to ask you to give me, I will not this bold, I will not have this boldness. Madam Kao Kabi and Yechineke. Bachelors which are Ibo Budo Ibo. Bachelors which are miracles. Spin sans each other is Iboji. This is your time. Yes. Omo wa each other. Special team. Marry their husband or their children. This is your time. Keep on coming. Keep on coming. Keep on coming. Allow God to touch you now. God bless you. God bless you. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We should be able to get up to twenty. We should be able to give up to, to up to twenty. Yes. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Keep on coming. The Lord is calling you. Dinna, the chineke goes in. I'm looking for more. God is looking for more. God is looking for more. Jesus Christ. God is looking for more. From 100,000, Gaba. Two, four, six, seven. Seven persons. Allow the Holy Spirit to touch you. I've given you a message. I'm not going to give you another one. Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. God bless you. God bless you. Come and answer God. Sisters, because I know you are busy. This is one of the most important time of this service. Can you read in Agari Agari Bikun? Amen. So, I'm looking for more. Is it only seven persons, St. Paul's? Kachine can I touch you here? I know that God is still going to touch you. I know that in about 50,000 you will come. But then, if you from 100, Gaba. Amen. And many of us were in Yenba. But I never enough. But God will surprise you. In the name of Jesus Christ. Yes. I'm looking for more. Thank you, Jesus. I'm looking for more. I'm looking for more. 
there's some pause. God bless you. Come and answer God. Come and answer God. Spin stars. Even with the 100,000, come and answer God. Mama, let it be the last card. The money you wish to pay for your children's school fees, call and give it to God. Oman is not easy. Kemara, machine kenna, kobara na kemonso. Oni nye kwe Oman is scholarship. Kemene ni Jose anya several. Abusi go ndege nye chuku one hundred thousand. Abusi go. I believe na abusi ben. Thank you, Jesus. I'm looking for more. I'm looking for more. Yes. I like it. It goes to somebody where I can't see any. Come and give God a seat this morning. Can better get better. Can mana me get win if I allow or not? Occulting powers and practices over your shed and business. Chineke ne wait you as a result of this program. I'm looking for more people. Okay, I'm going to pray for Nde 100 Gaba. Thereafter, we pray for Nde Genye Chineke 50,000. But actually, three more persons who believe in miracles to make them turn if you believe in miracles actually i'm three persons who believe in miracles and when i lay hand on you get for that god jima param goro three persons who believe in miracles got for one one hundred thousand can you call three persons three persons Thank you, Jesus. Amen. God bless you. God bless you. Two more persons. Okay. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Two more persons. I'm looking for two more persons. I didn't know when the other person came out. Two more persons who believe in miracles. After my prayer, Chile can we keep me here again? You get divine help and divine partner in your business. Come and join. But whereby you do not believe in miracles, don't come. I'm looking for somebody who believes in miracles. God bless you. Amen. Amen. And the Lord will surprise you. The Lord will surprise you. God bless you. God bless you. Two more persons. Two more persons. Two more persons. I want to pray. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10. Amen. I'm going to run your song. I'm going to chin it. Can I go to Gabia? Please, mommies and daddy, I want you to stand up and come this way. Can you come down? Do not shed tears. God. Is the one you have, you've come to give to, and he's going to surprise you. Thank you, Jesus. It's well, it's well. Please, I want to give you the microphone to announce what you wish to give, and then I will lay hand on you. I want you to be Hana Tonubi. If I be a servant of God, Chile can know yet. I got my metal guy this morning. Give him many the same. Or did you do miracles? And now for people going to mind them borrow how many? How many? People going to mind you. I'm on a phone now. Okubu, 
Several of them, eh, is cancer. They eh, see it on the neighbor, the chine can go on life today. So, eh, believe from chine con your porom. The noia zaga better. Amen. Only a hundred thousand more, but I got a hundred. Amen. Coro Jesus, I did you hear? Did you hear? Cosiera Jesus, I kick one hundred and five hundred. Hallelujah. Amen. Hundred, hundred. Hallelujah. Six hundred. Six hundred. Kopuru Jesus, I can't. Thank you, Jesus. Jehovah, I'm a mother. Amen. Two hundred and fifty thousand. Amen. Two fifty. Oh, Jesus. Mama. One hundred and ten. One hundred and ten thousand. Hallelujah. One hundred thousand. One hundred thousand. One hundred thousand. Amen. Mommy. Hundred thousand. One hundred thousand. Now, One hundred thousand. One hundred thousand, sir. One hundred thousand. Amen. One hundred, sir. One fifty thousand. One fifty thousand. Jesus, sir. Amen. Father, amplify my hand. Cause my hand to be turned to be your hand. I don't know the desires of these your children, but the truth is that. They've made something good to happen for you. They are not surprised every one of them. Cause them to know that you are a rewarder of them that diligently seek you. In the name of Jesus Christ. I lay my hand on your life. I hear your voice. God said I should tell you, I am going to fight your battles. I want you to mark this word. I do not know the battles right on your life. But the Lord says... I will fight them. Amen. I lay my hand. I don't know, sir. And I'm awful. There are several blessings that God in heaven has destined, but all of them are not coming directly to you. If for one and I ashi and gozigi naboro from Chineke. Abba GMO Kuha in the name of Jesus Christ. If I pray for you, if you have um, written your name and your destiny, you may go in. Daddy, thank God for your life. Amen. I hear this voice. The Lord asked me to tell you. He said, you know I've made you to be a giver. He said, you should not be discouraged. He said, you should not complain. He asked me to tell you. He said, whatever you give out does not finish. And so as you keep on giving, long life and other things will be your portion. In the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. I thank God for and I still hear this voice drink more water drink more water than you have been drinking you will live longer by taking much water please adhere to it thank you sir amen hallelujah and I'm a fool and your job on an end and goes again your job on before this time next year, you and your household would have become something better. Mark, I hear now, in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Did you know what I hear? I hear affliction will not come back the second time. I'm not what that is happening in your life. Man, if affliction will not come back the second time. If woman I got to go up or not, when you give a I destroy it in the name of Jesus. Amen. Mama, I'm a mafu, oh, beyond ma, oh, beyond ma, maybe no. Because Ghani read the name, yelling them, Madaka, more and more. A Pupanaka, if for when I can know about your life, about people, go make you move beyond your. God said, I should tell you, I've not created you to have a stony heart. He says, I'm giving you the heart of the flesh. And he says, he will fight your battles. Amen. 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 That is uh, 110. Thank God for mommy. He said the Lord asked her to step up. So instead of 100, there is 110. Now, can we clap unto the Lord? 
I lay my hand on you. Ah, I hear this voice. You will eat the fruit of your labor. Are you fine? So, devil is a liar. You will eat the fruit of your labor. So, keep on laboring now. A time of fruitfulness, a time of joy, a time of celebration and harvest. Nabia, congratulations. Amen. Ah. Meeting up on an inwenegi. By indoor job. A guzum na ha Jesus. That all of them will scatter on your behalf. Look at God asked me to give you Isaiah 54, verse 15. In gathering, they shall gather. He said, as long as it's not in the gathering, they will stumble. Maki henna baga rejoice in nine. The Lord has taken charge and control. Amen. Hey, sir. And I'm for peace on your forehead. Peace. Udo. If I get away, we put down now for what? Waiting in here, Ruju. I destroy such in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. I don't know how many children you have. Anna Manolo, keep on praying. You see, one of your children is going to be very great. They, 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 they might have reason. Manolo will love Chineke Kachor. And the more you pray for them, the more Chineke get Meron Weafa. Hallelujah. Can you call Jesus, Aka? I want to pray. After me, be from the children here, Chineke from 50, from 50 Gaba. You know, this is a special day. We have a project. from 50. Can you quickly come so that I will lay a hand on you? And again, if you hear the chair, God bless you. 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 Amen. Praise the Lord. Can we stand up? Let me pray the last prayer. Everybody stand. Thank you, Jesus Christ. Bariba Shinda Halagodo. Marabala. Close your eyes. I want you to lay your hand on any affected part of your life. As I pray now. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, in Luke chapter 9, you commanded us to heal the sick wherever we go to preach the gospel. Lord, because you have brought me here, I pray you, O oh Lord, straight forth your right hand of blessings your right hand of healing your right hand of deliverance your right hand of freedom and touch this your children i stand on your name i command you spirit of sickness projected into this life die now die now die now get out of this life into the dry place and never come back again in the name of Jesus Christ, I decree you are healed in Jesus' name. I want to pray for another set of people. You have not known Jesus as your personal Lord and Savior. It's your name, and Jesus. Or you want to know God more this year. Just raise your hand. Let me pray for you where you are. You want to know God more and you are saying, God, help me to know you more. Or you want to accept Christ as your personal Lord and Savior. Can you raise your hand up? Let me pray for you. Amen. God bless you. Can we pray? Father, I commend these men and women into your hands. I pray, oh Father, that you open their spiritual eyes to know you as their personal Lord and Savior. Oh King of glory, oh Lord of loves. I want you to give them the power to live for you. According to John chapter 1 verse 12, he says, as many that received you, to them you get power to become your children. Cause them to be desirous of the heavenly things more than the earthly things. I decree the Lord will help you. He will empower you to live a Christian life. To use holiness as a lifestyle. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. I was to... Shall we turn our hand together for the Lord Jesus? Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Let us remember that five o'clock this evening, the marriage, that is the husband and wife will come for the bottom pot. God bless you. God bless you. Can we jam our hand together for the Lord?